Hi, my name's Nick Burnham and I'm down at Salton's Marina in Poole for motorboat and yachting looking at a brand new boat in the UK. It's called an Anytech. It's an all aluminium construction and it's designed very single-mindedly for fast commuting. There's no sleeping on this boat, it's just a seating, a nice cabin area and a big outboard. It's designed to get you and your family or friends from point A to point B very fast indeed. This particular model is called the 747. We're about to take it out and see if we can make it fly. Now the interesting thing with these boats is that any tech don't do any bolting together. Everything is welded, so the boat feels absolutely rock solid. Here in the cabin, you've just got a pair of very comfortable sprung bucket seats with a helm and navigator, and there are a couple of bench seats behind. On the outside of the boat, you've just got a small forward cockpit with a door from here through to the forward cockpit, and that's got seating in basically the bow and in the corners, and then another small cockpit back aft. The visibility is very good. There's plenty of big windows all the way around and there's a sliding roof above us here as well. Um, but the nice thing is that I suppose being a Scandinavian boat you could expect it but this boat's actually fitted with central heating. We're here on February, it's a nice bright day. It means we can crank up the heating, close the roof and be really nice and cosy in here. Now the other nice thing of course is that being February there's nobody about here in pool on a weekday the speed limit is lifted and what that means is that rather than booting down at six knots as we normally do we can open the throttles a bit and get ourselves out to see if we can give the boat a proper workout. So up on planing speeds there's a couple of things that are immediately evident. The first is how very quiet the boat is at this sort of speed. It's uh, The engine is of course an outboard so it's outside and with the door shut it's really muted noise levels in here. The other interesting thing is just how slowly the boat will plane. We're doing about 17 knots here and the boat's absolutely dead level. So you can actually run this boat, it's a little bit choppy, at nice low speeds but still on the plane and being very comfortable in terms of your visibility and the way the boat feels. But of course this boat isn't about doing 17 knots. This has got 300 horsepower on and it only weighs 1300 kilos. What this boat is about is going very, very fast, so we're going to try that now. If you're looking at the running shots that we've cut in on this video, it probably doesn't look that rough, and that's because when we filmed the boat this morning, it was fairly calm. We've come out here this afternoon and it's really picked up. Some very, very big seas out here, and it's really putting this boat to its paces. Now, the one thing I'll say is it feels absolutely all of a piece. It really does feel rock solid. Um, going into it when it's not really the ideal conditions for this boat, it's a very short, steep chop, and the suspension seats are certainly having to do their job. But turn and run with it, as I'm doing now, and it is just amazing. You need to trim the boat up, get it up running above the waves, and it really does live up to its name, it really is flying. What you find is almost total sensory deprivation. I mean, we're doing now 25 knots. I can pick that up. That's 30 knots. And there's still loads to go. I saw 42 knots earlier, very, very briefly. And it's uh, it's remarkable. There's so much run there, it's incredible. But uh, that speeds where we are now. That's about 25, 26 knots. That's in a big sea. And that's coping with it very, very well. We're running back into pool with it. There's lots of white caps out here, lots of rolling swell. It's very confused, but this boat is just champing through it. It's a real ground cover up. Well, that was an experience. 
I think it's safe to say that if you want a boat to come down for the weekend and spend the weekend on very comfortably, or if you want a boat just to lie around in the sun, this is probably not the boat for you. However, if you want a boat to get you there, and I mean really get you there, this will do that. Mm -hmm.